jungle. The binary abacus is used to explain how computers manipulate numbers. The abacus shows how numbers, letters, and designs can be stored in a binary system on a computer or a via a ASCII. The device consists of a series of beds and parallel wires arranged in three separate rows. Napier's Bones is a manually operated calculating device created by John Napier of Merchant of Merchant Zone, Scotland for the calculating of products and equations of numbers. The method was based on lattice multiplication and also called rhabdology, a word invented by Napier. Napier published his version in 1617. Pascal is a direct adding machine. It has no crank. So the value of a number is added to the accumulator as it is being dialed in. By moving a display bar, the operator can see either the number stored in the calculator or the complement of its value. And that is why lies Pascal. The Leibniz wheel works by cranking a handle which moves a cylinder with a set of eight stiff wheel inside the device with a counting wheel that moves if the step wheel moves it and invented by Gaspard Wilhelm von Leibniz. The Jockard machine is a device fit fitted to a loom that simplifies the process of manufacturing textiles with such complex patterns as brocade, damas, and matilaisi. The resulting ensemble of the loom and jacquard machine is then called a jack jacquard loom. The analytical engine was a purpose mechanical general purpose computer designed by English mathematician and computer pioneer Charles Babbage. It was first described in 1837 as the successor to Babbage difference engine which was a design for a simpler, simpler mechanical calculator. The tabulating machine was an electromechanical machine designed to assist in summarizing information stored in punch cards. Invented by Herman Hallred, the machine was developed to help process data for the 1890 US census. The Harvard Mark I or IBM Automatic Sequence Control this calculator was a general purpose electronic electromechanical computer used in the war effort during the last part of the World War II. One of the first programs to run on the Mark I was initiated on March 19, 1994 by John Paul Newman. Now, you're not in